What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. My name is Sparkman. Today I'm going to show you how to enable ray tracing in Unreal Engine 4. Before we begin, don't forget to subscribe and leave a like. Okay, so let's open the Epic Launcher. So we're going to go here, click here, and uh, we are going to create a shortcut, which I already have here. Let's right click, properties, and uh, all you have to do is uh, write this at the end of the um, the target. So it's dash DX12. This is all you have to add to this line. Hold the Windows button and press R. Okay, so in ROM we're going to type this. So it's DX DIAG. <laughs> How do you say that? All right. So let's do that. Just uh, type it there. Okay, so here at the bottom it should say DirectX 12. You can see that my system is um, junk. <laughs> All right, let me open us in here. Let's go to project settings. Where is Windows? That's a window. In here, just make sure that you have um, DirectX 12. So let's find rendering here somewhere. That should be here under, um, right under physics. Now, when you change this, uh, the system will ask you to restart. Okay, so just restart. But um, I don't have to do it for mine. So let me show you what it looks like. Okay, we'll slow down a little bit. But uh, you can see the reflections there on the glass. It's a bit slow on my system. But it's perfect once you render this. More reflections there. In the next video, I'm going to show you how to create an animated sequence in Unreal Engine 4. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Bye now.